Greetings from the Green Mountain United Methodist Church, your conference workbook team, and myself, in consultation with the worship committee and the board of trustees, have decided to postpone in-person Sunday services for a while longer and remain in what the manual is calling red light status. That means no in-person. Uh, yellow status begins, reads the manual, when state and local officials have reported a 14-day downward trend of cases and there is no evidence of a rebound in our local area. Well, obviously, that condition has not yet been met, so we wait. In the meantime, um, the good news is we do have detailed procedures in place and ready to put into action whenever conditions are safer and more favorable to open. And this Sunday, we are introducing a fuller online worship experience with, we hope, more of the feel of actually being back in church. Uh, for those who are interested, we also have several United Methodist hymnals available for checkout. Please feel free to come on up to church and to borrow one from the table outside the sanctuary until we begin in-person worship services at a later date, or you feel like it's safe for you to return until you're ready to return. Um, I know this decision uh, is going to come as a relief to some of you while a disappointment to others. Please know that your representative team arrived at this decision after a lot of study and discussion and prayer. Our primary concern remains the safety of the entire congregation from newborns to nonagenarians. <laughs> And our own bishop, Karen, has said in the workbook that she does not want one single case of COVID-19 traced to one of our churches because we did not care for those whom Jesus loves. So, that's all for now. I want to thank everyone for their patient perseverance, their hopeful expectations, and their joyful confidence in what God continues to do among us in cooperation with us, both within and without the church building. The church is not a building, sings the Richard Avery and Donald Marsh hymn, United Methodist Hymnal number 558. The church is not a steeple. The church is not a resting place, but the church is a people. Sometimes the church is marching. Sometimes it's bravely burning. Sometimes it's riding. Sometimes hiding. Always it's learning. But maybe John Wesley's brother, Charles, an accomplished lyricist himself, expressed it best in a hymn that Methodists have been singing from the very beginning of the movement close to 300 years ago. It's in the United Methodist Hymnal, number 553. And are we yet alive, writes Charles, and see each other's face. Glory and thanks to Jesus give for his almighty grace. What troubles have we seen? What mighty conflicts past, fightings without and fears within since we assembled last. And yet, out of all the Lord has brought us by his love, and still God doth his help afford and hides our life above. So let us take up the cross till we the crown obtain and gladly reckon all things lost so we may jesus gain 
My brothers and sisters, peace be with you. And may good health, the best, be yours this day and always in body and spirit, graced by God in Christ.